Can you tell me about your own music, music for the austerity? Yeah, this is a, 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 my way of, as it were, keeping a, a hand on the creative life, as it were. Um, it, it's a project which I started uh, only a few uh, years ago, but in fact I've always composed music all my life, but I've never been trained, nobody's ever taught me harmony, and nobody's ever taught me to play a musical instrument, so everything I've learnt, I've learnt on my own. And I like doing this for several reasons. Uh, one is that it is a creative activity. When I work with uh, other creative people, it, it's nice to know or at least have some insight into what is going on in their minds when they are uh, approaching the creative process. Um, secondly, I think it's, it's also good to be engaged in something which is, is an intellectual activity, a creative activity. I encourage everybody to do that, whatever it is. Uh, and it's also, I think, good from um, a kind of psychological point of view. I'll try and explain this. It's a, that um, when you um, talk to composers uh, and you talk to them about their works, what they don't talk about is the things that musicologists and critics talk about. They don't talk about how they inverted the theme in the second movement and stuff like this. What they're really doing all the time when they're working is wondering, what the hell do I do next? What do I write next? And um, I appreciate that, because that's also what I do. But then I think to myself, well, isn't that what we all do all our lives in our relationships and in our jobs and in, in just in daily life? We're all wondering what we do next. And I think this is um, artists, composers, painters, whatever you want, whatever art form you wish to talk about, that's ultimately what they're doing. They're showing us what you could do next. It's kind of a, a, a set of options. I think for me that's what's the interest, interesting about art and I have a little motto which is that uh, art can't change the world but it can help the world to imagine change and I think that's what artists are actually doing for us and why we like them so much.